Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I would like to show you how to compile NRG Ljubljana code, which is an open source numerical renormalization group code, which is very useful in calculating quantum impurity problems. So this is the official website. Uh, you could just go to the download page, save file. And then the nice thing is that it comes with very detailed installation notes. Basically, if you use one of the operating system that is listed here, it's very easy to uh, compile this code. Basically, follow all of the lines here. Um, in my case, I use Ubuntu 20. So it is basically the same, except that we have to change the boost library from the default one, which is too new for the code, otherwise it will give some error, to uh, 1.67. Yeah? I will show you in a moment how to do it. So now it has already been downloaded. We just go to the download folder. And then you see that um, there is a compressed file here. Let's first decompress it. Yeah, OK. And, and then we list the files in the folder. And you see that this is the new folder. We go into the folder. And then later, we will need to compile everything inside this folder. Before that, the first thing to do is to run those code here to prepare the dependencies. So first, we update the list, and then we install the M4 library. Now, the build essential, it has already been automatically installed. And then we need to change this line. Yeah. OK, I will show you here. Basically 1.67. If you use Ubuntu 18 or below, just follow this line here in the official website. Yeah? Because there, the boost library is OK. But uh, starting Ubuntu 20, the boost library is too new. So we have to use the old version. Just run this line of code here. And then yes, this will take a while because it is a bundle of packages. OK, now after finishing installing the boost library, we continue with the list. And starting from now, everything is the same as in the, as in the official guideline. OK, now the GSL library. Then the Atlas library, basically, that takes care of the linear algebra. One thing to notice is that if you have already some other software, for example, VASP or Quantum Espresso compiled on your system, you should be careful because this may override some of your dependencies and then you need to reconfigure your VASP or uh, Quantum Espresso on your computer. So in the next video, I will show you how to use Intel MKL and Intel compiler instead of this Atlas library. And hopefully there is no dependency issue there. And also it will be faster than this. Yeah. And then the next step, it has already been done. And you see those two steps, basically, it means that you download the compressed file and decompress the file and go into the folder, which we have already done. The next is to export some uh, flags. Basically, this is the flag for the C++. And then this is the flag for the linear algebra library. And then we consider everything using this line of code here. There's no warning, no error. That's fine. Then we just compile everything using the make command. And this will take a while, and we just wait. So now this is finished. We could uh, go on to the next step, make install. Basically, that will move the executables to uh, the directory that you defined here. And this would be uh, the NRG folder in your home directory. So we'll do this. And then we go to the home directory and list the folders. And you see there is an NRG folder. Go to the NRG folder everything is inside yeah and then we go back to the download folder because we don't want to download anything inside the nrg folder now we use this line of code to download the quick test 
and this is down. Then decompress the quick test. We list the files inside. You see that it's in this folder. Go inside this folder. And then the important thing is that before you run the code, you need to export the path. So basically here. If you don't want to do this every time, you could uh, add this line of code in the .bashrc file, maybe in the end, so that uh, every time you open the terminal, it will automatically be executed, and you don't have to run this code again. OK. And then we just uh, run the energy calculation, and you see that it starts the calculation and now it finishes. OK, so in this tutorial, I have shown you how to install NRG Ljubljana code using the official guideline, basically with GNU compilers and serial compilation, basically only one CPU core available. Although this NRG calculation is usually quite fast, sometimes you still want to make it more efficient by enabling parallel computing as well as using Intel compilers if you use Intel CPUs. So in the next video, I will show you how to do that basically change this Atlas library to Intel MKL and also change the GNU compilers to Intel compiler, which enables you to run jobs on multiple threads, which reduces the execution time and increases the efficiency greatly. So thank you for watching, and I hope to see you next time.